Just a Second, A Different Way to Look at Time by Steve Jenkins. A second goes by pretty quickly. In fact, several have passed since you started reading this sentence, and they just keep going by. There are 60 seconds in every minute, 3,600 in every hour. Most people will experience more than 2.5 billion seconds in their lifetime, but a lot can happen in a second. Some surprising, even amazing things can take place in a very short time. Other events unfold more slowly. And that's what this book is all about. The second doesn't relate to any cycle in nature. It's a human invention and the shortest interval of time. The Babylonians came up with the idea of the second about 4,000 years ago, but they had no way to measure such a short interval of time. In one second, a vulture in flight flaps its wings once. A hummingbird beats its wings 50 times. A bumblebee beats its wings 200 times. A midge, a kind of gnat, beats its wings 1,000 times. In one second, a rattlesnake shakes its tail in warning 60 times. Black Mamba slithers a frightening 24 feet. A very fast human can run 39 feet per second. A human can blink 7 times in one second. In one second, somewhere in the world, 4 babies are born and 2 people die. A stone dropped from a rest falls 16 feet per second. The Helios 2 satellite zoomed 43 and a half miles. This is the fastest a man-made object has ever traveled. The Apollo 10 spacecraft traveled almost 7 miles during re-entry. The fastest humans have traveled in a man-made vehicle. In one second, 1,500 chickens are killed. The minute, like the second, isn't based on any natural cycle. The 60 minutes in an hour, like the 60 seconds in a minute, are based on a Babylonian counting system that was in use thousands of years ago. Did you know that in one minute, a person walking at a brisk pace covers about 300 feet. A three-toed sloth hauls itself about 10 feet. A giant tortoise lumbers about 15 feet. A charging grizzly bear gallops one half mile. When you say just a minute, the moon travels 38 miles in its orbit around the Earth. A person standing in one spot at the equator travels 18 miles as Earth rotates. Other things that happen in just one minute. An elephant's heart beats about 30 times. A very chilly crocodile's heart may slow to just one beat per minute. A hamster's heart beats about 450 times. An adult's heart beats about 70 times. A child's heart beats about 100 times. In one minute, people around the world drink the equivalent of 2,600,000 12-ounce soft drinks. Around the world, 59,000 barrels of oil are used. Almost 15,000 of them are used in the United States. All of these things happen in just one minute. The hour was also created by humans. The hour we use today comes from the Egyptians. 4,000 years ago, they began dividing the daytime and nighttime, each into 12 parts. Did you know that in one hour, an average of 19 gallons, 72 liters of fresh water is used for every person on Earth? An adult takes about 900 breaths in one hour. A mole can dig a tunnel 20 feet long. A baby blue whale feeding on its mother's milk gains almost 10 pounds. 7,500 pounds of space debris, most of it dust, falls to Earth every hour. The day is based on the rising and setting of the sun, the time it takes Earth to make one rotation on its axis. The day is the original unit of timekeeping in every human culture. Did you know that in one day, chickens around the world lay 2 billion eggs? A female flea can lay 100 eggs. In one day, a mayfly larva hatches, lives its entire life, and dies. In one day, 50 new species of plants and animals are identified, but another 150 species goes extinct, most because of human activity. People use the equivalent of 200 billion sheets of letter-sized paper each day. Over the ages, people found it useful to have a unit of time longer than a day, but shorter than a month. Weeks have varied in length from 3 to 20 days. Our 7-day week originated in Babylonia around 2,500 years ago. In one week, a monarch butterfly on its annual migration flies 700 miles. A migrating bar-tailed godwit flies 5,500 miles. A ladybug can consume more than 500 aphids. A giant pumpkin can gain 150 pounds. Moose antlers, the fastest growing tissue any mammal, can add 6 inches to their length. 
In one week, two mice, a male and a female, meet and mate. We'll check in with them again soon. After the day, the month may be the oldest human unit of timekeeping. A month on our calendar is roughly based on the time it takes the moon to go through a full cycle of its phases, about 29 and a half days. In one month, 84,000 new books are published. The hair on a human head grows a half inch. In one month, human fingernails grow one eighth of an inch. In one month, our two mice had an average litter. There are now 12 mice. The year is based on the time it takes for the Earth to make one full circuit of the sun. Along with the day and the month, the year is one of the three basic units of time shared by people throughout history. In one year, an estimated 50 people are killed by sharks. More than 2 million people are killed by mosquito-borne diseases. The moon moves one and a half inches further away from the Earth. In one year, Mount Everest rises half an inch. In a year, humans cut down four billion trees. Global warming causes a sea level rise of about an eighth of an inch. Seafloor spreading moves the United States one inch away from Europe. And in one year, if all the offspring of our original pair of mice survived and mated, the two rodents would now have more than one million living descendants. In our universe, some things, such as light traveling across a room, happen much too quickly for us to notice. Science has given us the ability to measure many of these very fast events, even if we can't experience them directly. Some things that happen very quick. A puff adder can strike, return to a coil position in less than one half of a second. A housefly can spot danger and take off in one tenth of a second. The trap jaw ant snaps its jaws shut in one eight hundredth of a second, the fastest movement in the animal world. The Shasta salamander, an amphibian with the world's fastest tongue, can snap up an insect in one one hundredth of a second. The human brain can register a finger touching something in one one hundredth of a second. A fastball makes the trip from the Major League Baseball pitcher's hand to the home plate in less than four tenths of a second. On a human time scale, some events occur very rarely. Others seem to take place at an impossibly slow pace. Here are some things that take a very long time to happen. Observing the most distant galaxies is like peering into the past. We are seeing them as they were more than 13 billion years ago. An object the size of an asteroid that may have killed off the dinosaurs collides with our planet about once every 100 million years. It would take 80,000 years for a spacecraft to reach the nearest star outside our solar system. A voyage across our galaxy would last almost 2 billion years. It will take a long time, but the sun will get larger and hotter. In 1 billion years, Earth will be too hot to support life as we know it. 2 billion years from now, Earth's oceans will have boiled away. Counting one number every second, it would take more than 31,000 years to count to 1 trillion. The oldest single living organism we know of, a bristle cone pine in California, is more than 4,862 years old. A koi, a kind of goldfish, lived to be 226 years of age. An ocean quahog, a clam, lived to be 405 years old, an animal world record. A French woman lived to be 122 years old. She holds the record for a human lifespan. Yes, it's true. In just a second, an awful lot can happen. Add those seconds together, even more can happen. There are so many interesting things going on in the world around us. I hope you take a second to notice each of them. I hope you enjoyed Just a Second, A Different Way to Look at Time by Steve Jenkins. This book brought to you by Proud Dad Productions.